Brought to you by Excel, makers of inexpensive and high quality Windows and Android tablets. Great gadgets for less. Hey everybody, it's Lon Seibin and we are here at CES 2015 at the very busy Intel booth uh, with Danny who was gonna talk a little bit about the Bay Trail process. You know, eight months ago we weren't even thinking about PCs that could cost less than 200 bucks and now we have a choice of PCs that cost less than that. You got a new tablet here running Bay Trail, I'm assuming, so. Actually we're running on, on Moorfield, so the new Intel Atom processor based on Moorfield, so our phone up silicon. Really, so this is a, a faster processor or just more efficient? More efficient, more efficient design. So uh, similar similar line as Baytrail, but we're gonna start phone up. So lower lower uh, power, higher efficiency, uh, great performance. Uh, it's the genera same generation, same process technology as, as Baytrail. Uh, this will be one process generation prior to our next generation, which will be Cherry Trail, and that'll be our 14 nanometer tablet processor that uh, will be out uh, this quarter. That's uh, the, I guess Intel has this tick-tock strategy, right? So, so the tick is the smaller, and then the talk is the new, the new update. Is that how it works? The talk is actually the new process. It's, it, it, it feels a little backwards in that regard. But so, Cherry Trail on 14 nanometer will be a talk. So, new architecture, 14 nanometer process, and uh, that'll be the new Intel Atom processor coming into this year. In fact, start, literally starting this month, this quarter. That's really exciting. So tell me about this tablet. What makes this unique? It's very thin. Is this what the processor allows you to do? Yeah, so this is the new Dell Venue 8. This is based on Intel Atom processor, the Morfeld gener generation. But what we've done with Dell and what we'll be doing with uh, all of our partners with the, the next generation Atom processor will be the incorporation of Intel RealSense technology, uh, specifically with our front-facing uh, Intel RealSense snapshot, snap, uh, snap, snapshot camera. <laughs> And uh, you know it's going to give consumers literally easy on the fly creative ability editing photos things that would take you 20 30 minutes to do in Photoshop if you had Photoshop and you knew what you were doing it literally take you seconds in fact I can give you a quick demonstration sure let's take a look so here we got a you know a picture a Venetian Venetian scene if you will here at Las Vegas uh, Venetian scene and uh, I can easily go into uh, a variety of uh, editing uh, features here so I can I can go and change the focus of the picture uh, I can say you know I really want the focus of the picture to be on 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 the boat on the driver and so what it will do is it will make that the focal point of the picture on the fly automatically and you see the foreground the foreground has become out of focus or soft focused likewise if I wanted to change the focus I simply tap and change the focus on the foreground and everything in the background drops out into a soft focus. And that's all integrated into the, into the on-system chip? On-system chip, part of, part of the Intel Atom processor with RealSense technology, part of the software that comes with that technology. Likewise, what I could do, I can go back. Oh, I don't want to do that. We can come out here again. And we could actually do color editing if we want. So we could come and uh, do some depth filtering. What I can do is, and these are these are Android, these are basic Android filters that come pre-installed with the camera, and we could say, all right, let's do black and white. And what we can do is real simple with the slider. I can change the color colorization of the photo, and and pick where the color drops in. And if I say, gosh, you know, I really want, I really want to drop it out, you know, I I want the I want the color to be in the foreground. I want the background to be in black and white. It's a simple, flip it. It's doing it very quickly, so this is something that you've integrated onto the die or at least onto the, into the video processing hardware to speed up this process. I'm guessing it uses less power while you're doing these kinds of calculations also. Exactly, and that's, that's sort of the great benefit of having the integration is that it's optimized for you know, really a power efficient form factors like this tablet. As you can see, it's a quite thin form factor, very light design. Uh, all, that has to ha all that has to happen with start starting with the chip. And you know, the mobile processors from Intel, at least the products out there, it's been an explosion lately of really inexpensive devices. So uh, you know, everyone was running ARM, and now everyone is like start suddenly going to Intel. So uh, what, what's what's the prospect for the company? Is it, you know is this a direction that Intel is heading in now to be able to serve the low end of the market, but also still provide the i7 that powers my beast too? Yeah, you know our our motto is if it computes and it, con and it connects, it runs best on Intel, and that that literally means the $79, 99 tablet tablet up to the 399 even 499 uh, premium tablet uh, and two-in-one and so it's very much the strategy you know we're tracking you know roughly 450 you know uh, distinct tablet designs coming into the year uh, all based on the Atom processor so we've got great momentum what are we, we going to see on the Cherry Hill uh, upgrade is that going to be additional video performance faster processors what are we looking at there 
You're going to see obviously exceptional scaling because we're going down in process. So we'll have performance scaling, just you know what we say IA computer Intel architecture compute scaling. We'll have that naturally, but we're going to have very good graphics performance upgrades. Uh, we're not talking about specific benchmarking data right now, but you can expect as as normal and especially with a process upgrade, uh, much better performance, better efficiency and a range of designs, again, in the tablet form factor up to uh, the two-in-one form factor. Excellent, thank you very much for your time, and uh, enjoy the show, it's a busy one. <laughs>